What's up, guys? Welcome to Ralph's Garage. Uh, sorry I didn't post last week. Holiday seasons. I wasn't actually going to post this weekend because of New Year's. Um, but I'm actually taking my time and actually making a video for you guys. And as you guys said, as you guys requested, I'm actually doing the leveler switch on my car. Uh, my girl's working on her car. She put her JDMs on. And she's cleaning up the bay a little bit because it had a bunch of wire harness. Like you can see right here, a bunch of wires, cleaning it up. Um, they fucked up the USDMs, HIDs. Uh, they ended up putting some aftermarket HIDs ballast because I guess one of them fucked up and they went the cheap route. Um, so we took off all this from her car. Um, and you can see from her, her headlight over here, how they kind of Mickey Mouse this. Um, and fucked it up. These are the US. And the difference between them is this right here. This has a great metallic look. It's kind of hard to see in video. And then the JDMs over here actually have a clear. So this is clear. The insert. Um, outputs the same. Just... They point a little different. Um, that's about it, man. Um, I'm going to show you how to do the leveler switch, which is this one right here. Um, so you could adjust the switch um, on my car. I haven't put it on. And like you guys requested, I am going to put it on. So stay tuned. All right, for the levelers, you're going to need the switch, the piggy bags. The piggy bags for the headlights, which are these. Um, and the wiring diagram, these two right here are the ground. These two right here are the signal to give it to the headlights. And then these two right here are for the for the light right here. Um, there's a little light that turns it on when, same thing with the, the cluster, whatever, whenever, whenever you turn on the lights. Um, I'm not gonna put a relay um i'll show you a link on how to put the relay i'm actually gonna put just a fuse and get it from the i'm gonna get power from the fuse in, in, in the in the engine bay um it's safer to run the relay but everything's running off of 12 volts so i'm not gonna do it uh do put fuses on it just in case uh this is the piggy bag and as you can see they're different colors but they're both the same. This one's the easiest one to figure it out. Uh, this is actually your ground. Then this is your power. And this is your signal. So this is the signal telling it what. And if you match them up, you can tell which one is which one. But just in case you don't, uh, this is also power. This one's also ground. And this is the signal. Just in case you ever do get two of these, you know. The, gr the light green one. Solid light green that's power and of course the one with white and black is ground and then the green with the stripe um that's your signal so just in case you have two of these they'll still work So I already did one side, um, as you can see, uh, this one right here, this is my ground, I grounded it here, um, then you got your positive right here, and your signal, which are these two right here, going from here to here, I put it underneath here, all the way down here, now it goes over here, now to do this side, well, I'm actually going to go work inside the cabin. The hardest part is going to get a wire. So I'm going to use a black wire to go from under there, from the switch, all the way down here. So that's what I'm going to do right now. And that's the hardest part to do. Um, there's a firewall right there with the wire harness. That's where I'm going to put it. Um, and I already did this one too. So 
This is actually my power, which I'm just going to get from one of the fuses here. Uh, I'm just going to see which one it is. Most likely this one. Get power from there. Um, just got to see which one I'm going to get power from it. So I'm just going to get power from one of the fuses there. Um, then ground my thing and then grab the one for the signal and connect both of them here for the signal. So this is a signal that goes from the left. From actually from the right headlight. This is going to be the right headlight. And then I'm going to get a wire from here from the switch. So I'm all set here, plug those up, plug it right here, I plugged it right there, got my ground again here on the fender. Um, this is my power, direct power, got it from one of the fuses here like I said, this is actually the headlight so if I know that um, my headlight's not working or my leveler is not working, it's the headlight fuse. Um, and then that's it. You got everything plugged up. I ended up getting the the signal underneath the box. It goes through here and then it goes through here. The wire harness, you can see it right there. It's right there and it goes inside. Uh, now let's go back in here. Um, as you can see, I have a lot of wires. Um, this used to be this used to be my automatic headlights, which I took the switch already. I'm gonna get rid of it because I don't really use it anymore. I like it manual. Um, and then this switch is for my LEDs as you guys saw in my previous video. So I had to make room for the leveler. And this is the signal already connected. I just need to connect the ground, which is this is the ground right here. And then another power for the lights. And this one, I'm gonna go get power from the fuses over there on the side. Uh, most likely, I'm gonna get something that turns on the light. Could be a, it could be um, the ignition switch or same thing, stereo or whatever it is. However, you want it to turn on. Um, most likely, it's gonna be the headlights again. Whenever this goes. I'm gonna have it turn on this one also. So I just find I have to find a fuse that whenever this turns on. So yeah, so I'm gonna run the wire from here all the way through the back over there to the fuse box over here. Um, and that's the last step I gotta do and then put everything back together and it should be working. Um, everything's not connected so I wouldn't know right now. So stay, stay tuned. So it's all done. What's it called? Um, I ran the wire from over here to the fuses. Uh, I actually put a fuse right here, put it on that fuse right there, which is the tail light. Um, it's a tight 10, so this one's actually a 15 on the fuse, the big fuse. So I gotta change that one into a 10, so make it all one size. Um, and there you go. Turned it on. Turned out blue. If I go swap thing. And you can hear the motors. My bro just put it. And you can't really hear the you can't really see the headlights because of the lighting but they actually do move they move up and they move down here's a better shoot of how these work look look at the light and that's one another setting another setting right there there's another one right there That's it. I just gotta put it back together and that's it. Call it a day. Yeah, uh, thanks to me you find out how to put this shit. Nope.
Yeah, you did. I fixed your wiring. So, I didn't say it, but Merry Christmas to you guys uh, and Happy New Year's. By the time you see this, it's going to be New Year's Eve. Don't drink too much. Stay safe. Yeah, drive. The last day of the year. Ass. Please don't drive your Celica. Yeah. That's all. Don't drive your Celica. If you're going to drink, fucked up your fucking daily get shit. A, get a designated driver. Use Uber and Lyft. Doesn't cost that much. Uh, I'm gonna give you a code. <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> well, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, leave your comment. I'm out.